Well, hello. Welcome to Subnautica Below Zero. I've never actually played the original and I probably should, but this is the one I have access to right now. Thank you, Ben. I've got my coffee in a Hogwarts <laughs> mug. So I guess I'm ready. I don't know. Probably. We're gonna... Uh... Yes. We're just going to start with the standard because, like I said, I've never played the original either. This is the first time I've played this. But, going to make the best out of this and record for like 10 minutes now because I have to go to work, so. <laughs> this is the farthest that I can take you on company space bucks, Robin. Ooh. You're sure you want this? The research is in everything. It is to me. And Sam. I need to know what happened. The meteor storm. I can use it for cover from Altera's eyes. Altera. <sighs> Gonna miss you, Robin. I'll find my way back. Is it just me, or is it like every sci-fi game, there's like a really headstrong character? Oh, like, especially, uh, maybe they're all based on Ripley. I don't know. Approaching 45, 46 feet. Surface temperature is drop pond deployed. No. Great job, Robin. Killing it. Well, that looks cool. Welcome to 45, okay, good lord. I don't state. even... Alright, time to go. Thank you. Whew. Okay, I know we're in the middle of a crisis, but look at this! These are beautiful. Holy smokes. Oh. Warm me up, baby. I should find a way into the water and get to the drop pod. Into the water. Let's not. We don't have to do that. <laughs> I'm playing a game called Subnautica and I'm like, hmm. Bet and not. I freaking hate. Okay, I'm sorry. I don't hate the ocean. But I do hate the ocean. It scares me. Hello. Should I touch you? Am I gonna. I. I just wanted to see if that would happen. It happened. We burned. Into the water. I don't know. So obviously there's my pod. Okay. Oh god. I'm gonna drown because I don't know how to do any of this. Oh. Cool. This is so pretty. Are you a frog? No. You're a fish. Definitely a fish. Okay, there's my oxygen. O2 levels. This is so pretty. I'm gonna like this, even though it terrifies me. Oh. Are there any penguins around? I just wanna see. <gasps> They're over there! Hello! Babies! Mommy's here. Leave me alone. Uh, how do I? Oh my god, what was that? Get me out of here! Oh my god! No! Okay, I'm just... I can't get out of here. We'll go down here, like we're supposed to. I don't know what that was. Okay, I guess it's a plant. <laughs> oh my god. Can I just... Please, nothing. Please don't eat me. Oh my god. This... I mean, it's beautiful. I'm having a great time. Oh, God. Okay. Uh. Enter. Okay, first of all. 
Now the dragon pod. First of all, I definitely would have let some water in. That's just physics. That's just uh, the way it works. So I don't know what to tell you about that. Oh, cool. Creep vine. So that's what that was, probably. Cool. And I really want to use a controller for this. Waterproof locker. Is that what that was? Maybe? I don't know. Okay. Voice log. Found the drop pod. Okay. Well, we don't need to see all that. Sam. I'm sorry about your sister. I want to offer my sincerest condolences oh. on the passing of your sister. I got to know Sam better towards the end of my mandate with Altera on 4546B, when we were thrown together as base mates at Outpost Zero. She spoke often and fondly of you. I thought you should know. It didn't sit right with me when Altera blamed Sam's death on negligence. The Samantha Ayu I met was many things. Kind, clever, devoted to her work, but never negligent. I wish I could offer you something more substantial, but my access to information has been cut off. You may be in a better position to look into things than I am. If you're able to, Delta Station was our HQ. They were in a big hurry to leave, and there might still be information to be found there. It has a big radio tower, impossible to miss. I hope you find the answers you seek. Lillian Bench. Uh-oh. There's a lot of messages, eh? Hey. Robin, guess what? I got the job. I'm going to 4546B. Now I'll be able to improve the mechanical avian amphibian under real-world stress conditions. Listen, I know your stance on Altera, but I just hope you're happy your sis is happy. I sure hope my sis is happy. <laughs> I can't wait till we talk again. Oh, I wanted to ask you something. Can you watch my Augie while I'm away? I need someone I can trust to look after my best little potato. <laughs> potato, listen. I tried, but that name is just not sticking. He's my little extra bite. I'll leave the starchy oh. tubers and nicknames to you. No. Anyway, if you say yes, thanks, baby sis. Love you. Baby sis. Okay, I'm baby sis. Interesting. Hey, Robin, I, I got your Augie photo. Thanks so much for taking care of him, even though he's a cranky potato. Hey, the nickname actually fits that way. A cranky potato. I know he can be a handful, but I really appreciate it. I'm a bit worried about my other baby, the mission. One of my panglings found something, something big. Mm. But Altera is just like nothing to see here. Honestly, kind of glad you can't answer so you can't, you know, rub it in my face. Go ahead, bask in the fact that you were a little bit right about them. My project is on the line. My job, my safety. Um, I heard about Xenoworks getting bought. I'm sorry. But at least you still have your job. Guess you're one of us now. Like it or not. Welcome to the Altera family. I, I should probably go before I say something I regret. Love you. Keep your chin up. Eye on the alien prize. These are very interesting. Hey, Robin. <sighs> I'm sorry my last message was so awful. I've been under a lot of stress. <clears throat> and I'm not sure what's going on with anything. I can't really talk about it either. Oh, and I'm definitely not dating anyone on this water planet. Don't know what I was thinking there. Have I told you how cold it is here? Get this. I can't even get my wash and go dry before the wind freezes the moisturizer in my hair. Wild, right? Well, anyway. I'm sure you're mad at me after what I said. But I, I could really use a friend. You're my sister. I love you. I'm sorry. Dang, I wonder what happened. Hey, Robin. Sounds serious. I really need someone to know. I'm afraid something terrible is gonna happen. You were completely right about Altera, okay? You were right. I was wrong. The cat should be called Potato. I admit it. <laughs> mm, it's 
sorry. Forced laugh. Last attempt at a joke. I, I just, I don't know what to do. I guess I should just come out and say it at this point. I've said this much already. We found a frozen leviathan that's infected with Kara. Altera thinks they can use it for something. Weapons, experimental treatments, a whole range of things. But one end of the range is ugly, dangerous, but, but profitable, of course. What if it gets out while we're messing around with it? Or worse, what if it ends up a bioweapon in the wrong hands? I, I hope I'm overreacting, but I don't think I am. Anyway, message me back, please. I could really use a friend. You're my sister. I love you. I'm confused. Why is she not responding to her sister, but then she's like, I'm going to go through a meteor shower to get to her. Whatever. Welcome to adventure mode, Xeno worker. You have arrived in an Arctic climate. Your great expedition begins. Your Xeno works PDA is equipped to monitor your temperature and vital signs. Okay, so this is this is what you should do. Quality intake recommended. Huh? You remember when in doubt, don't go out. Yeah, this you're telling this to the girl who just flew in through a meteor shower. Okay, cool. So it looks like we probably need to go collect some stuff. But also, okay, that'd be nice to have. I think we're supposed to be looking for our sister, and of course, but I don't think that's gonna, we're gonna find anything anytime soon, honestly, so. Well, Sam, I guess I might as well gather some tools and resources before starting my search. Hope that radio tower is as easy to spot as Lil said. Well, there you go. Okay, eat something. Thank you. Um, I haven't had time to really work on getting a better controller situation. What are you? Can I eat you? Oh, kind of fast. Oh my god, I don't like this. Why did it- did it get darker? Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> okay, so there's our thing a thing. There's a lot of noises. Oxygen. Oh, thank you. So, very cold, and I'm supposed to survive. But I don't have any food, and I'm obviously... Oh, break limestone. Should be able to use this. Cool. Oh, sea glider. Okay, but I can't collect it, I guess, right now. Come here. Let me catch you. New gotcha. creature discovered. I catch bladderfish. Huh. Oxygen. Ah. Uh, I need to catch the. What is going on? Whoa. Whoa scared it. Okay, so I can't catch everything, I guess. So... Ugh. What is making that noise? I don't appreciate it. What are you? Emergency. Starvation I'm, imminent. I see calorie in ah, Come here. This would be easier with the controller. Oh my god, this is so not my style. New creature discovered. Uh, can I eat you? <laughs> what do I use you for? Oh, okay. New blueprint synthesized. Do you guys have any food? <gasps> oh my god. What? Oh, hello. Hi. Hi! Oh. Hi. Hi. Hey, y'all got any food? I'm hungry. This is stressful. I don't- I don't play survival games. My, uh... 
pretty much everyone else around me does. My mom is, like, actually a bigger gamer than I am. I'll admit it. She plays. Ooh, quartz. Can I eat that? Stardew Valley, anyone? Oxygen. Wait, I'm collecting things. Ooh, can I eat that? Is that kelp? Oh my god, I'm gonna die. Hurry up! Creep vine. Can I not... Grab any of this? Oh, cool. Wait, what? <gasps> oh, that's cool. Can I eat you now? Oh god! Oh my 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 god! What? What? What was that? Oh my god. I'm I still need to eat. I'm going to die. If something doesn't eat me first, I don't know. I'm just going to die of starvation. Hello, another one. Oh god. Why am I so stupid? I'm too stupid for this game. Oh. Oh. Calorie intake. Ah. Eat. Eat it. How do I eat? Uh, I don't know how to eat. Ah! I I did it. Eat. Vital signs stabilizing. I was a little nervous about dropping into an unknown area. But luckily, this biome seems to have an abundance of minerals I can use for tools and upgrades. I didn't want another situation like Byzantos 5. When Xenoworks dropped me off, there were barely any resources. I survived off the land for three months with just a knife, my lucky PDA, and some rope. I am still kind of proud of that, though. Is that me? Yes, personal log. How did you- when did you do this recording? I don't remember that. It's a little weird. Huh. Okay, so I'll need a bladder fish for that. Okay. Oh, that's cute. Well, I figured out how to freaking open it. Jesus Christ. Oh, what a beautiful sight. Well, this has been fun. I will... I haven't done anything except for eat. Try to... I haven't done anything except for hunt for food. And pick up some random minerals on the way. But I will be back and I will continue this journey.